oh 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 Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, um, another video up this week. Yes. Okay. So, um, I was in the mood to film. I just really was in the mood to film, and um, I kind of did this look yesterday. It was a kind of nude makeup look. I was trying out a new palette, um, but I wanted to do it again today. But obviously, I've kind of I've added a few things to it. So anyway. This is the tutorial for a nude matte makeup look for women of color. Um, I love it, guys. It is <sighs> popping, if I don't say so myself. Uh, yeah, I really like it. Um, I really like it. I actually really like it. So if you uh, want to see how I achieve this look, continue watching. If you aren't already, please subscribe to my channel. Um, comment below if you like the video and thumbs up if you also like the video and I'll see you next time. Bye! Oh, oh, oh. So I'm starting off with my favorite foundations at the moment and those are the Revlon Colorstay Makeup Foundations. I have combined hazelnut and caramel together and I am using my new Elizabeth Arden makeup brush and this is actually in like a hard shape and I think this brush is so great for those foundations that have a really mattifying texture. They blend, it blends those foundations in so so well um yeah so i really love it i'm actually doing two layers of my revlon color stay because i really want a full coverage look get high grade from a distance baby i'm going insane red crowns baby come to my aid shawty said he busted my brain like a migraine your game my game your loss my pain slow down the way you go down you know now now me they run the whole town king of the city cause i wear that gold crown so give it up for bad man better than bad man i didn't impress these dogs and kill this cat I am going in with my LA Girl Pro HD Concealer in Fawn. You know what it is. Bugatti, join me in my Bugatti. Only you in my Bugatti. Only you in my Bugatti. See my Jeep Seeger, she summoned into my set. She be mine in my place, she looking at my eye order. She be moving so quick, you never see her coming. She wants to wonder. She and me, she's like the baddest girl me I ever ever seen. Something like a queen. She your number one lover, her tank. I'm going in with a brighter concealer on my nose and my forehead along my T-zone actually. Um, and I'm using the Estee Lauder Double Wear Concealer in Medium Deep. Fall for my sky, panties are dropping, throwing the towel. She's a, she's a professional. I think, I think I'm lost in the love life. We came strong together. She got a strong desire. Up to the morning after. Now she's moving. I am now priming my eyelids with my MAC Soft Ochre Paint Pot. She be mad in my place. She looking at my eye order. I am now baking with my MAC Translucent Prep and Prime Powder and I'm baking all the areas where I put my concealer so that's underneath my eyes, on my nose, forehead, around my mouth and chin. She wants a wonder, but man, na na na. I'm also just using some translucent powder on my primer just so that it doesn't crease and my eyeshadow can blend easily. Now for eyeshadow, I'm actually going in with my contour powder and that is the Revlon 
new makeup compact i think is the name and i think it's in the shade cappuccino i'll double check that for you and yeah it makes a really good transition color actually because it is a nude look i am keeping most of my colors brown so um that's why i have decided to go with this powder and then for my outer corner of my eye i am going in with my mac times nine palette in amber and i'm going in with this um dark brown i believe the shade is called embark once again I'll double check that for you i'm just going um lightly with that in my outer corner just to define the eye socket and then all over my lid i'm going in with this very pale um peachy brown color which i think is really 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 pretty and i'm packing that onto the lid all of these shadows are matte and in the brown color family so it's all good so i'm sort of loving this liner guys i've never been a fan of foul tip liquid liners um but i'm really loving this one from mac it is very pigmented it doesn't dry out um mid stroke and it is quite matte and very black so um i really am enjoying it until i stock up on my inglot 77 gel liner See your number one lover, hot tank, cool. you be begging her, please. No, if you tell me on, I'll take you on, then I'll put you on, girl, girl. Feel me now, the thing that you want, thing I got it on, girl, girl. See me falling, fall from my sky, panties are dropping, throwing. I'm also getting used to this felt tip liner. I don't think I like it. I don't think I'm convinced, but we're gonna go ahead anyway. <laughs> so um, I am lining my waterline with the um, NYX Jumbo Pencil in Milk, I think it's called. And then I am going on my lower lash line again with my contour shade. Um, and then I'm going over that once again with Embark. For my lower lashes, I'm using the Revlon Ultimate All-in-One Mascara. I just love the bristle. It's so short and tiny and I can really get um, into the lower lash line hairs. I'm now contouring with that contour powder i've been using this whole look and um i'm really liking powder contouring these days and i really like this specific powder just because it's more of a bronzy contour as opposed to that very dark um obvious sculpted contour so um i feel like it still it still sculpts my face but not so harshly as a very dark um contour um powder might do k to the e to the k na 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 I am using my favorite blush which is MAC Raisin and then very shortly I'll be dusting off the translucent powder. I am now saturating my face with some Fix Plus because baking really does make my skin look very dry but don't worry even with all the Fix Plus it'll still look matte um, and then I am applying my falsies uh, these are custom lashes because I did stack the MAC 35 lashes with the Iowa 117s Kill this cats man Raps man these older guys are rats man When I get on stage all they do is clap man So make you join me in my bro I am using my favorite highlighter right now which is Cheeky Bronze by MAC um, I'm really liking the peachy undertones and I'm going to be using that all summer I feel um, yeah, it's very subtle but still does the job as opposed to a very harsh, more uh, pearlescent or white looking highlight. My lips today are a combination. I get asked so many times about the lipstick that I'm wearing, so pay close attention. Okay, this is MAC Chestnut Lip Pencil. 
mixed with Stila liquid lipstick in Caramello. I'm going to use my hands to really pat this in just because when I use my hands I just feel like it really um, sinks into my lips and it really just stays there. It looks more like a stain as opposed to a lipstick. Um, I really, really love it. And we're done. I'm just going to go over my face once again with some Fix Plus. And that's the look. Oh, 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 K to the E to the K. Na, na, na. She wants to see wonder, want to get high grade From a distance baby, I'm going insane Red cross baby, come to my aid Shorty said he busted my brain like a migraine Your game, my game, your loss